put me with that much belts like that. Damn. So sad. KKK. KKK. Young nigga, I got old cats spazzing on their ass. I got Prada on my whole ass. What's going on, guys? It's your man C to the J to the C. Y'all already know how I be. And welcome back to my channel. Y'all know how I do. Like, man, I'm sweating. I just did a feast. Like, I cook for everybody in my house. You see, that's the kind of genuine person I am, bro. Y'all know what it is. The best story time teller on YouTube. Nikki Clary don't got nothing on me. Olivia Carr don't got nothing on me. Tana don't got nothing on me. Y'all already know, bro, what we doing here, bro. There ain't no competition. So the first thing I need y'all to do is subscribe to my channel so y'all can be updated with the latest story time, the best story time, the funniest, saddest, and even most entertaining story time I ever see with your host, me, C to the J to the C, straight from 305, Miami Dade County, live in Orlando, came here for college, graduated college December. Y'all already know the deal. So now let's go straight into it. No time to converse. Now I'm birthed from the old world. Y'all know how it is. So today's story time, I'm going to talk about the biggest and most in the worst ass whooping I got from my dad growing up. So my dad always loved collecting um basically I would say living room stuff. So he needed the living room stuff to design the, the living room, make it look good, make it look fancy, you know, for like uh, 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 for people when they come to the house so they could be impressed and things like that. That's what he always like. And he always tell us if you in the living room, always take out your shoes. Don't get in the way. Things like that. Like, basically, like, he basically make sure that you ain't going to, like, mess up the things I just bought. And we all understood. Me, my brand sister, we all was disciplined, things like that. So, one day, my dad was going out. He was like, I'm going out. I'll be back in a couple of hours. And we all just chill. We said, all right, all right, things like that. So, he leave. So, when he left, me and my brother was playing wrestling. You know how you and your brother always want to wrestle, see who's the best. So we would flip each other, like basically punch each other in the face, things like that. And then basically like, bip, bip. And then it's like, one, two. We love wrestling too much. All right. We know fanatics. But we would just like flip each other, try to slam each other, things like that. Punch each other, like going to, 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 to on top of the, um, the chairs and basically jumping like we're from the top ropes. All of that good stuff. So then, um, my brother, he was kind of beating my ass. So I had to find an advantage. So when he wasn't looking, I basically took him and went, bam, and I slammed him on the table. And that table that I slammed him on was basically like the table that my dad just bought. So the whole table just went bloom, and it broke. So when it broke, my brother's like, oh, shit. He was just like, oh, shit. Like, he said, oh, snap, you in trouble. Like, if that far, oh, snap. He's like, and then he, his back was hurting. He wasn't even worried about the injury. He just worried about what's going to happen to me when all that found out. So it was crazy. It was just like, oh, snap. Like, basically, like, what we going to do? I said, well, I told him, what we going to do? He said, what do you mean, we? What you going to do? I said, bro, I'm a <laughs> I said, you better stop playing with me and help me. And then he was like, we said, you better find a way. So basically, like, yeah, like, I'm panicking. Dad comes in an hour. I had to think fast. I told my sister, oh, can you say one of your friends came over and basically messed it up? She said, you ain't going to lie to uh, about my friends. My friends didn't, don't deserve it. So all that shit, things like that. And I told my sister, you always want to have their back. Like, the one time I need you, the one time I need you, you can't have your bread back. She's like, that's your problem. You got to fix it. So I'm like, all right, then all right, we, we going to see, <laughs> and things like that. So I'm in my room, like, panicking. My brother is, like, his dumb ass, like, on his phone, like, da, da, da. like, that's none of his business. And I'm like, all right. So dad came. My dad opened the door. First thing we heard, like, what the hell is this? He was like, what? What? And he said, what the hell is this? And then like, we're like, oh, shit. And then he said, CJ. And he said, my brother named Mercilin. Mildred, get your asses in the living room. And then we was like, oh, shit. And then we got here. He said, who broke this? And then my brother and sister looking at my bro, my brother and sister looking at me like you better tell the truth you know that. And I said, I said, I said, Dad, Dad, I'm gonna tell you the truth. And he said, What? He said, I know you always tell the truth. What? What happened here? I'm like, 
Mercer and broke it. I said, my brother broke it. And then he's like, what? My brother, like, what? He broke it. He broke it. And my brother and my dad was like, who broke it then? Who broke it then? And I'm like, like I'm like, chill, chill, chill. Everybody like, he, like he broke it. And so like, he keep on lying. And my sister was like this. No, don't even lie like that. And my dad said, who you talking about? Who's lying? And then basically my brother said, it was him. I said, no, nah, it was him. I swear it was him. I was in my room. He broke it. And he told us to lie for him. All of that stuff. <laughs> Bro, I wasn't going to get no as with for nobody. And then basically it was just like back and forth, blah, 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 all that stuff. So then when uh, uh, when my dad had nothing, he said, that's it. And he told my old brother, he told my brother, you the oldest. You got to make sure shit like that don't happen. And he said, so now go get the belt. And my dad, my brother, like, I ain't even do shit. It was him. It was him and things like that. I said, stop lying. It was him. He said, bro, stop lying, bro. And he said, you ain't gonna fight in front of me. Like he said, he said, he said, you, you the older one. You gotta make sure shit like that don't happen. I leave for two hours and this shit happened. And I was, and I was like, ah, and stuff like that. So me, I basically went to go get the belt and I was like, here. And y'all know what y'all thinking. You don't even feel sorry. I said, bro. <laughs> I, I I couldn't I couldn't help myself. Like I'm not trying to get the ass whooping. I could imagine my dad the, the go, um, come up with for breaking that table because that table nearly cost like a hundred in cash. So basically, I got the the, the 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 belt and I went to my room and you heard ah, ah. he he whooped my brother ass so bad, <laughs> bruh. <laughs> like, they ought to do arcs, arcs, like story arcs on how bad he with my brother. That was part one, two, and three. Like, bruh, I was in my room like, ah, ah, said, it wasn't me, it wasn't me. And I'm like, it wasn't me. <laughs> like, bruh, in my room, and like chilling. So then, you know when you sleep with a guilty conscience, I don't know how about something, I'm like, in my room like, damn, he really got ass whooping. My brother didn't say shit to me. He, he was like in his bed, and I could tell he was pissed. So then the next day came. You don't see the broken table no more. I think my dad threw it outside or something like that. My sister, when we were going to school, she said, she said, he said, you green for that. Like, I wouldn't expect that from you. Like, how could you let that happen? Things like that. I'm like, man, I said, y'all know and things like that. Like, come on, man. And he's like, and then he's like, he's like, for you to let that happen, like, what the hell, bro? Like, Nah, you 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 something up for that. I'm like, man, things like that. Like I didn't care. As the day went by, I did think about it and I knew I was wrong. So when I got home, my brother wasn't talking to me, my sister wasn't talking to me. I went to my dad, I said, Dad, you know how yesterday I said it was my brother who did it? It was that was a lie, it was me. My dad said, What? I said, It was me. I took him, I slammed on the table. My dad said, go get the bell. And then he, he got the bell. He said, no, the big one. I'm like, dad, what do you mean the big one? And he said, pull your hands out. Because my dad used to like when we put our hands out like this. Like you got to put your hands out to feel that bell, like really feel it. And then he was like this. He said, 22, 22 um, ounces of, of, of belt whoopings. You ready? And I was like this. He, he, he acted like he was going to go for my head. My dad took my body. He was like, you whooping me like you thought a slavery whooping was bad? He whooped, he whooped the blackness out of me. Then the blackness came back. Y'all see, I'm black. <laughs> but like, damn, like, my dad would be ah, ah. And then you heard the screaming, and my sister was laughing in her room, her dumb ass. And she like that. My bro was laughing, but as I was taking it, I knew I did the right thing. Because I'm saying, I could have just let that slide go on through and my dad never know the truth. But I feel like him knowing the truth makes it better and we can move on with that. So I had a clear conscience. It was good that way. And yeah, man, like my dad whooped the, t bruh, I was shivering for the whole sleep. I couldn't even sleep that night. It was a bad whoop. I, I still got marks from that day, bruh. Y'all just don't want to know. But it was crazy. I learned my lesson. I learned that. When your dad buys stuff, don't break it. That's what I learned. But all right, man. It's your man, C to J to C. And remember, like I always say, bro, like, subscribe, and comment. Don't just like some, bro. Some of y'all just like, man. Like, subscribe, and then comment. And y'all know, just do your thing. Always stay chill. Always stay cool. It's your man, C to J to C.
And I'm out. Be breezy.